when things bubble or become bigger, we talk about it. And mm-hmm. we have collectively 120 something years of experience in schools. Mm-hmm. And for us, the experience is what we're really going on and really al- allowing, especially, like I said, as we update our handbook, it's so impossible to only just have the one experience and say, this is how it's going to be every time. And we're trying mm-hmm. to be much yeah. more upfront about that. It's shifting every single time. Mm-hmm. We can guarantee we have people who care who know your kid very well and who understand it's hard as parents because you're focused on your kid we can only address them as they come up and we do have like you said processes for that it's a question often of who thinks what and how can we bring those things together and then also what will that mean for for the next time something like this happens and how are we addressing it with the layers of anxiety mental health uh, uh, neurodivergence that people are owning differently than they used to be and in a time when social media allows you to see examples of anything that your heart desires uh, or that you might feel in that moment. And these kids, the kids are so, they have language that Mm -hmm. I never had. Mm -hmm. (laughs) This is the Agentic Schools podcast, where you will learn about schools from around the world, where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living more important than their academic skills. I'm your host, Don Berg.